hello there welcome to my channel so today we are going to make this very cute tar uh, utility basket so you can use it to put your earrings or anything that you want and also you can make it as um, as big as you want or as long as you want and uh, please take your materials ready and let's get started okay so we're going to start with the magic ring and then we'll do six single crochets into the magic ring so we'll do single crochet one two three four five six okay Then I'll take my marker and place it over here. So now in the second row, we are going to increase every stitch around for a total of 12 stitches. Okay, so I'll go into the next stitch and increase. I'll also increase in the next stitch. Okay, and I'll continue increasing all the way until the end okay so now in the third row we are going to do single crochet then increase and repeat all the way around for a total of 18 stitches so we'll do single crochet then increase in the next stitch and we'll repeat single crochet increase and continue repeating that all the way round okay so now in the fourth row we are going to do two single crochets then increase and repeat all the way round for a total of 24 stitches okay so we'll do single crochet one two and then increase in the next stitch and repeat two single crochets and increase and repeat that all the way round okay so now in the fifth row uh, we are going to do three single crochets then increase and repeat all the way round for a total of 30 stitches so we'll do single crochet one two three and increase and we'll repeat so three single crochets and increase and repeat that all the way round okay so now in the sixth row we are going to do single crochets all the way around for a total of 30 stitches so you continue and do single crochet single crochet single crochets and you continue like that all the way round okay so after that now we are going to start making the sides and uh for the first one we are going to start uh by doing so i'm just going to place my marker so we are going to start by doing six single crochets so we'll do single crochet one two three four five and six okay and then we'll do a chain one and turn okay so in the second uh, row we're going to do six single crochets so we'll do single crochet one two three four five 
five and six and then again we'll do chain one and turn and we'll do six single crochet so single crochet one two three four five and six okay and then we'll do chain one and turn so now in the fourth row we are going to decrease so we'll go into the first stitch pull through go into the next stitch pull through and pull through all the three loops together so that's one decrease and then we'll do single crochet in the next two stitches so single crochet single crochet and then decrease in the last two stitches okay so and then we'll do a chain one and turn so now in the fifth row we are going to do three single crochets so single crochet one two three and one more in the last stitch so four single crochet then chain one and turn okay and then we are going to decrease two times so we'll decrease and decrease again one more time and chain one turn okay and then now uh, in our next row which is the last row we are going to decrease okay and then I'll do a chain one and cut off the yarn okay so the next one we are also going to do the same way so here uh, where we the la in the last uh, stitch where we did the first row where the first row of the last uh, pair of finishes we are going to attach our yarn over there so I'm just going to pull it through and do a chain one okay and then after that I'll do the same way as I did the same one so you do six single crochet then turn and repeat the same way we did this one and you're going to repeat that all the way round okay so when you're done this is how it should look like so you should have five sides like that so this is going to be the base of our little basket so now uh, to make uh, the upper side we are going to continue and do single crochets all the way around until we get here where we started so I'm just going to place my marker over here okay and then I'm going to continue down and do single crochet single crochet like that single crochet Okay, so this is how it's looking like. Okay, so you'll continue like that, doing single crochet all the way until you get here again where we started. So after we're done uh, working single crochets, this is how it looks like. So now in the next row, we are going to start also working inside uh, the stitches, in, uh, the ones that we did in the first row. Okay, so instead of working inside here, uh, the usual single crochets, we are going to work in this stitch. As you can see here, 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 like that. Okay, 
so i'm just going to demonstrate okay so we're going to go in here in the first stitch as you can see so it should also come through here and pull through like that single crochet okay so next one we're going to go in here put your crochet hook through so it should come out like that as you can see and pull through and we're going to continue like that all the way until the end Okay, so you continue working like that all the way round. Okay, so after you're done, now in the next row, you're going to continue the same way. So you're going to go here and do single crochet and continue like that. Okay, so this is how your basket should look like on the outside okay and on the inside you can see how it looks like okay so you're going to continue like that all the way until uh, until uh, you get to the height you want your basket to be okay so and then I'll see you when you're done and then we're going to finish up together Okay, so now I've already finished making mine. So I did a total of five rows. So this is how it looks like, as you can see, very cute. Okay, so now to finish up, I'm just going to go into the next stitch and then I'm going to slip stitch. And I'm going to cut off the yarn like that. Okay, and I'll pull it through the other stitch like that and then you cut it off okay so this is how it looks like okay so guys I hope you enjoyed this video if you have any questions you can ask in the comments below and please check out my other videos until next time bye